Boa tarde. Na nome Sipiwe Baleka. My name is Sipiwe Baleka. I am the Minister of Foreign Affairs for the Provisional Government of the Republic of New Africa. And I am also a coordinator for the Decade of Return Initiative in Guinea-Bissau. Um, <clears throat> I am sending this message out to the Afro-descendant people who live in Portugal and Brazil, uh, and also um, to the people in Angola, Mozambique, Cape Verde, and Sao Tome and Principe. As a result of the president of Portugal's statements regarding Portugal's responsibility for crimes against humanity, including the enslavement and colonialism against African people, and their need, uh, the need for Portugal to take responsibility and pay costs. We in Guinea-Bissau have called for the establishment of the National Reparations Commission in Guinea-Bissau. We are urging the Afro-descendant people in Portugal and in Brazil to also call for the establishment of your National Reparations Commission. The structure for the Global African Reparatory Justice Movement was called for in 1993 at the gathering in Abuja, Nigeria. And the Abuja Proclamation called for the establishment of national reparations committees uh, in every nation in Africa as well as in the diaspora. Since then, a number of national reparations commissions have been established. In the Caribbean region, there are 12, or I think around 12 national reparations commissions as part of CARICOM. In addition, you have the National African American Reparations Commission. There are reparations commissions in um, European countries such as the Netherlands. And right now is the moment where the Lusophone African regions can join this global African reparatory justice movement uh, by forming their national reparations commissions and then preparing their 10 point program uh, and submitting presentments to the government of Portugal. Uh, so this is my message. I had a meeting earlier today with Miriam Taylor, who I met at the third session of the United Nations Permanent Forum on People of African Descent, where we did a lot of strateg strategizing on the way forward for the global African reparatory justice movement. Uh, and this entails um, several things, including a request for an advisory opinion from the International Court of Justice. Um, there are many other, uh, there are many other actions that are being discussed and implemented. But right now we need to take action and utilize this um, statement from President Souza of Portugal, their responsibility to provide reparations, um, to get organized and have the national units in place to form a global reparations movement and agenda. That is already in uh, being implemented right now in these national reparation commissions is the mechanism uh, for the Afro-descendant people in Brazil and Portugal, uh, as well as Guinea-Bissau, Sao Tome and Principe, uh, Cape Verde, Mozambique and Angola um, to get involved in this reparations movement. So I look forward to hearing your progress. I am available as well as other National Reparations Commission chairs are available uh, to help guide and advise you and help you in your response if needed. Obrigado.